In the U.S., the first civil trial that could hold a drug company responsible for the opioid epidemic has begun. It pits the state of Oklahoma against Johnson & Johnson, a company best known for its baby products. It's now been accused of corporate greed that led to an oversupply of addictive painkillers that fueled the drug crisis. The multiple months of discovery, uh, hundreds of depositions, millions of documents have convinced us even more that the proximate cause for the prescription opioid epidemic in our state are companies who marketed fraudulently the addictive qualities of the drug over two decades, uh, in many cases knowing that there was a high probability that patients would become addicted, uh, but focusing on, tragically, profits uh, as opposed to people. The state accuses Johnson & Johnson of hyping up the effectiveness of opioid painkillers and downplaying the risks of addiction. That led to an addiction epidemic that claimed some 4,600 lives in Oklahoma between the years of 2007 and 2017. Two other drug companies named in the lawsuit settled ahead of the trial, leaving Johnson & Johnson as the only defendant. The company denies any wrongdoing. It says its products have helped thousands of people manage pain and are heavily regulated.